Some new information tonight. Changes could be coming to a local school after a basketball game this past Saturday. We first told you about this last night here at 11. And according to Ledger and Colchester school officials, some adult fans with Bacon Academy yelled racist taunts at the Ledger girls basketball team. Joining us now with the latest on the investigation, Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Christian Cologne. Christian, I know you've been following this story. What is the latest? Yeah, Mark Aaron, both districts determined that Bacon Academy parents did yell racist things at the Ledger basketball team. Several witnesses tell us they have heard that they were yelled the N-word. Tonight, the Ledger board chairman says they will be modifying their policies in response. On Saturday night, Ledger High School faced Bacon Academy. After the game ended, some Bacon Academy adults yelled the N-word at the Ledger players. What happened to us was a hate crime. And people are saying, like, that word is just like a bad word. It's not just that. It's literally a word that put black people like like literally like used against us for years and calling us that is the most disrespectful thing you could do. Nicole Walker is a senior at Ledger and wants the academy team suspended after what she heard. Taylor Gunning was a fan in the crowd and is now working with police after what she also witnessed. I was shocked. I, I truly could not believe that these kind of things are still happening. So far, no arrests have been made, but tonight, the Colchester superintendent says he believes these racist events did happen, adding, I offer our full and sincere apology to the Ledger High School basketball players who were the targets of this abuse, as well as their families. This behavior does not meet the standards we promote in the Colchester schools, and we must do better. We do not have any evidence that this involved our students. Um, our student athletes that were part of that team really take a look at the cultural context of what's happening within the building um, and start working on a plan for the spring to see what we can do that's systemic and, and system wide, at least within Bacon Academy. As for Ledger, the chairman of the board says he agreed on the superintendent's actions of banning those adults who yelled the racist words from school events and buildings, adding to reinforce his action and our intolerance to this type of behavior. The Board of Education will be discussing modifications to the conduct on school property policy at the upcoming Board of Education meeting. And Bacon Academy officials add they are aware some of their athletes are being harassed online. They are asking the public to end this immediately. As for the students at Ledger, they are still shaken by all of this and want these schools to act. In the studio, Christian Colon, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.